The Baroque Churches of the Philippines are a collection of four Spanish colonial-era Baroque churches in the Philippines, which were included in UNESCO's World Heritage List in 1993. The churches are also considered as national cultural treasures of the country. World Heritage Site 677 the 2013 revision of UNESCO's World Heritage Site WHS 677, Baroque Churches of the Philippines, includes four churches. San Agustin Church in Manila The San Agustin Church in Manila, also known as the Church of the Immaculate Conception of San Augustine was the first church built on the island of Luzon in 1571, immediately after the Spanish conquest of Manila. A site within the district of Intramuros was assigned to the Augustinian order, the first to evangelize in the Philippines. In 1587 the impermanent earliest building in wood and palm fronds was replaced by a stone church and monastery in stone, the latter becoming the Augustinian mother house in the Philippines. It was the only structure in Intramuros to survive the liberation of Manila in 1945. Miagao became an independent parish in 1731, when a simple church and convento were built. However, destruction of the town by Muslim pirates in 1741 and 1754 led to the town being rebuilt in a more secure location. The new church, constructed in 1787-97, was built as a fortress, to withstand further incursions. It was, however, damaged severely by fire during the revolution against Spain in 1898 and in the Second World War. Two bell towers were added in 1854, but the northern one cracked in the 1880 earthquake and had to be demolished. In the interior of the church the wall paintings date from the 19th century, but they overlay the original tempera murals. As a result, the church was richly endowed, with a fine retablo, pulpit, lectern and choir stalls. Of special interest is the series of crypto-collateral chapels lining both sides of the nave. The walls separating them act as buttresses. The stone barrel vault, dome, and arched vestibule are all unique in the Philippines. A monastery complex was formerly linked to the church by a series of cloisters, arcades, courtyards and gardens, but all except one building were destroyed in 1945. Santa Maria Church the Santa Maria Church is located in the municipality of Santa Maria, Ilocos Sur. Unlike other town churches in the Philippines, which conform to the Spanish tradition of sitting them on the central plaza, the Church of Nuestra Señora de la Asunción in Santa Maria with its convento are on a hill surrounded by a defensive wall. Also unusual are the sitting of the convento parallel to the facade of the church and that of the separate bell tower, characteristic of Philippine Hispanic architecture, at the midpoint of the nave wall. This was dictated by the hill on which it is located. The brick church follows the standard Philippine layout, with a monumental facade masking a straight roof line covering a long rectangular building. It is alleged to be built on a solid raft as a precaution against earthquake damage. The walls are devoid of ornament but have delicately carved side entrances and strong buttresses. PAOAY Church the PAOAY Church, also known as the Church of San Augustine, is located in PAOAY, Ilocos Norte. It is the most outstanding example in the Philippines of an earthquake Baroque-style architecture. Fourteen buttresses are ranged along the lines of a giant volute supporting a smaller one and surmounted by pyramidal finials. A pair of buttresses at the midpoint of each nave wall have stairways for access to the roof. The lower part of the apse and most of the walls are constructed of coral stone blocks, the upper levels being finished in brick, but this order is reversed on the facade. The massive coral stone bell tower, which was added half a century after the church was completed, stands at some distance from the church, again as a protection against damage during earthquakes. Miago Church the Miago Church, also known as the Church of Santo Tomás de Villanueva, stands on the highest point in the town of Miago, Iloilo. The church's towers served as lookouts against Muslim raids and it is the finest surviving example of 
Fortress Baroque, the sumptuous facade epitomizes the Filipino transfiguration of Western decorative elements, with the figure of Saint Christopher on the pediment dressed in native clothes, carrying the Christ child on his back, and holding on to a coconut palm for support. The entire riotously decorated facade is flanked by massive tapering bell towers of unequal heights. Other sites, nominations and programs Aside from the churches included in World Heritage Site 677, another church which is inscribed in the UNESCO World Heritage List is the Vigan Cathedral, included in Historic City of Vigan, WHS 502 RAV. The Philippines, a country with hundreds of historical churches, is promoted to be more active in the engagement of the national government and concerned private and public entities to establish more UNESCO designated church heritage sites in the Philippines to safeguard national treasures more effectively and to promote promote the country's booming tourism further. Extensions proposed for World Heritage Site 677 Tentative sites The current official tentative sites for extension are the following Lobok Church of Lobok, Bohol, was also a part of the former Jesuit Churches of the Philippines nomination. Buljun Church of Baljun, Cebu Giwan Church of Giwan, Eastern Samar, was also part of the former Jesuit Churches of the Philippines nomination. Tumuini Church of Tumuini, Isabella Lazy Church of Lazy, Sakihar Former tentative sites the following churches used to be in the tentative list of the Philippines, but were removed in 2015 by recommendation of UNESCO due to the current status of the churches. Once rehabilitation is completed for all of the churches, they may again be included in the tentative list. Currently, the San Sebastian Church has ongoing renovations. Baclayan Church of Baclayan, Bohol, as a part of the former Jesuit Churches of the Philippines nomination. Marigondon Church of Marigondon, Cavite, as a part of the former Jesuit Churches of the Philippines nomination. San Sebastian Church in Manila, as a single nomination. National Cultural Treasures The Philippine National Commission for Culture and the Arts NCCA, has also designated the conservation and protection of more than 30 other Spanish-era churches to be of utmost importance. These were registered as national cultural treasures. These churches were given priority status not just due to their historical value, but also based on the geographic representation of various regions across the nation. Parish Church of San Agustin in Baking, Negros Oriental Parish Church of the Immaculate Conception in Balayan, Batangas Santiago Apostol Parish Church in Betis, Guagua, Pampanga Parish Church of Patrocinio de Maria in Buljun, Cebu II Parish Church of St. Rose of Lima in Gamu, Isabela Parish Church of Saints Peter and Paul in Calishao, Pangasinan Parish Church of San Vicente de Ferrer in Dupax del Sur, Nueva Vizcaya Parish Church of the Immaculate Conception in Giwan, Eastern Samar 1, 2 Parish Church of Saints Peter and Paul in Teguegarao City, Cagayan Parish Church of the Immaculate Conception in Jasan, Misamis Oriental Parish Church of San Juan Bautista in Jimenez, Misamis Occidental Parish Church of San Isidro Labrador in Lazy, Siquijor 2 Parish Church of San Pedro and San Pablo in Lobok, Bohol 1, 2 Parish Church of Santa Catalina de Alejandria in Luna, La Union Parish Church of San Carlos Borromeo in Mahatao, Batanes Parish Church of San Guillermo de Aquitania in Magsingal, Ilocos Sur Parish Church of San Gregorio Magno in Majayje, Laguna Parish Church of the Assumption of Our Lady in Marigondon, Cavite 1 Parish Church of San Andres in Masinlik, Zambales 
Parish Church of Santa Monica in Panay, Capiz Cathedral of San Jose in Romblon, Romblon Parish Church of San Joaquin in San Joaquin, Iloilo Parish Church of San Juan Bautista in Tabaco City, Albay Parish Church of San Ildefonso in Tanay, Rizal Parish Church of San Pablo in San Pablo, Isabela Basilica of St. Michael the Archangel in Tayabas, Quezon Parish Church of Santa Catalina de Alejandria in Tayam, Avra Parish Church of San Matias in Tumuini, Isabela II Parish Church of Santa Cruz in Maribajac, Bohol Parish Church of San Andres Apostol in Bacara, Ilocos Norte Cameron de la Virgen, Parish Church of Nuestra Sra. de los Desamparados in Sta. Ana, Manila Parish Church of Our Lady of the Gate Eastern and Western Facades, Belfry and Baptistry, in Daraga, Albay Parish Church of Our Lady of Light in Lune, Bohol Parish Church of Santa Monica in Manalan, Pampanga Parish Church of San Nicolas de Tolentino in Dimiao, Bohol Important Cultural Properties Parish of the Holy Sacrifice in Up Diliman, Quezon City San Agustin Church, Lubao, in Lubao, Pampanga Our Lady of Assumption Church, Bulacan, in Bulacan, Bulacan National Historical Landmarks Abake Church Historical Landmark in Abake, Bataan Barasoyan Church Historical Landmark in Malolos, Bulacan Church of Baylor Historical Landmark in Baylor, Aurora Lubao Church Historical Landmark in Lubao, Pampanga Chapel of the Holy Sacrifice in Up Diliman, Quezon City San Sebastian Church Historical Landmark, Quiapo, Manila, Calamba Church Historical Landmark in Calamba City, Laguna Church of Pate in Pate, Laguna Tall Church Historical Landmark in Tall, Batanga Cathedral of Boac Historical Landmark in Boac, Marinduque Quipeo Church Historical Landmark in Calabanga, Camarines Sur Barotac Nuevo Church, Convent and Cemetery Historical Landmark in Barotac Nuevo, Iloilo Domangas Church Historical Landmark in Domangas, Iloilo Ermita Chapel Historical Landmark in Domangas, Iloilo Jaro Belfry Historical Landmark in Jaro, Iloilo City Molo Church Historical Landmark in Molo, Iloilo City Baclayan Church Church Historical Landmark in Baclayan, Bohol One Church and Convent of Santo Niño in Cebu City Church of Nuestra Señora de la Concepción Historical Landmark in Argo, Cebu Church of San Guillermo de Aquitania Historical Landmark in Dalegay, Cebu Church of the Most Holy Trinity Historical Landmark in Loe, Bohol Mawson Church in Mawson City, Southern Leyte 1 on August 15, 1993, these churches, along with the one in Baclayan, Bohol were nominated for World Heritage Sites status as part of the Jesuit Churches of the Philippines. Point two on May 16, 2006, the NCCA nominated a new set of churches as part of the extension of the Baroque Churches of the Philippines World Heritage Site. With the inclusion of two churches from the Jesuit Churches nomination, these two proposals will likely be combined. See also Baroque Architecture Spanish Colonial Architecture Earthquake Baroque Architecture of the Philippines References External links UNESCO.org, World Heritage Baroque Churches of the Philippines Profile NCCA.gov. PH, NCCA Profile of the 26 Baroque Churches of the Philippines Nomination of Jesuit Churches of the Philippines as a World Heritage Site nomination for the extension of the Baroque churches as a World Heritage Site.